just not an easy thing for me to bring up. This is going to be the first time that you're seeing one of those movies without your wife. Yeah. It's another bridge to cross, you know. That maybe you wanted to go to a wedding with me. That's my plus one. I have crossed plenty by now. Right. I really like you. That's not weird, is it? No, no, no. It's, it's great. I'd, I'd love to go. Yeah. We're still on for a date night, aren't we? I like you too. It's a date. <laughs> All I'm saying is that involuntary physical reactions are usually rooted in traumatic experience. Which you and I have both had plenty of. Could you be the famous Victoria Palmer that I've been hearing about? I'm just letting you know that this is why Victoria likes hanging out with me. You yeah, know, well, that's not the only reason. Next time Josh or anyone does this, try thrusting the palm of your hand up into his nose. It'll line up for a couple of seconds, which is much better than a punch. She actually likes you. I know. I think. Maybe. She's been here a lot about you too, Agent Knight. Victoria? Nice to meet you, Agent Knight. That was the never-ending pushback of a preteen. It's exhausting. But Victoria is the sweetest kid I know. Whenever you're around, as soon as you leave, she morphs into some devil spawn hellbent on questioning every word that comes out of my mouth. Victoria's like a little mini Jimmy Palmer, and it is in their DNA to like everyone. But there is one more bridge for you to cross. And I think that one's gonna hurt the most. It's me being a part of your daughter's life. I just don't know if you want to be that dad. How does this make me that dad? I mean, she is way too young for this, right? I wonder if it's more about whether Vic is mature enough to handle this. Jimmy, are you cyber-stalking the boy who's crushing on Victoria? Neither of you is the father to a daughter. That's the last bridge. I can't understand it. The final symbol that Prina has really gone. With all the bad that's happened this year, why deny the good? And we have something good. And I think, don't we? You feel like you're saying goodbye to her for good, and I know that has to hurt. Do you think we should find out? I mean, you know, that you like that. You and you and me. Well, you and me as in us? You and me? Yep. That. Yeah, of course. I mean, why are you even asking? I don't want to push you. I feel really bad for having pushed you. Just stop, stop. Just stop. You have nothing to apologize for, okay? I think that we should do that again, you know, just, just to make sure. This is something that I have to do, and, um... Has Jimmy mentioned anything lately, you know, about him and me? I just feel useless right now. It's really hard. I understand. Trust me. I didn't crush, and I didn't do butterflies, and I didn't, you know, put notes in people's lockers. So why are you suddenly twisting yourself into knots over Jimmy? Jess, I'm not going anywhere without you. Catch a wave if you're afraid to get on the surfboard. Jess, I was being selfish before about needing to put like a label on this. Labels don't matter. All that matters is you. Night, Jimmy. Night, Jess. I love you. I love you too, Jimmy.